and an MPS basketball coach has been placed on leave for running an unauthorized fundraiser. Ben Jordan talked with a Grand Tosa Drive elementary school parent who's now on the hook for hundreds of dollars. I feel like my son was played. I feel like you know, I was played. Kenesha Woods sold $240 worth of popcorn under the impression that it would pay for new basketball uniforms for her son's sixth grade team. Over the years of them playing for Grand Tulsa, I noticed, you know, they just provided them with like regular t-shirts. So it was like I was interested in, you know, seeing the team and my son in these new uniforms that they were promised. Woods says the coach told her the popcorn would arrive earlier this week, but just before she saw a post on Facebook from another parent who said they had been scammed. I also called him and he gave me the same story. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was supposed to be getting some money back from a settlement. I thought my money would be back in time so I can put the order in for the popcorn. Milwaukee Public Schools sent today's TMJ for a statement that reads in part, Milwaukee Public Schools is aware of this situation and is working with the Milwaukee Police Department to investigate the matter. The staff member responsible for the popcorn sale is on leave until further notice. Woods and other parents filed police reports as school administrators directed them to do. Now she's trying to figure out how to pay back their unhappy customers. If, if I can get them the money back myself to pay them back because at the end of the day, that's relationships. I reached out to the coach in question, but I haven't heard back from him since he hasn't been charged with a crime. Today's TMJ4 is not reporting his name at this time. Reporting on Milwaukee's northwest side, Ben Jordan. Today's TMJ4.